Hello again my friends, the weekly reset is here once again and surely we all know what that means by now don't we? Yes we fucking well do! Loot! Sweet! Precious! Loot! In this video we're gonna look at my Hunter's Weekly Reset Loot Haul. Let's do this! So then, as always I'm gonna start by opening my three sterling treasure packages. Now I already have both the ships and the sparrows so what I'm looking to get this time around are the Hunter Cloaks. I have neither of these Hunter Cloaks so that's what I'm hoping to get this time around so let's do this fancy animation time cloak is what I want a booyah we got the spectre boots and we got some crucible reputation booster action let's see what I get in the next package I want the cloak please to add to my collection we got the desolate legs not good enough what we want is the cloak I have a huge hunter cloak collection I want to add this to it boom nice we got the spectre cloak so I don't actually have that as I said previously, so let's see what that looks like. This is the first time I'm going to see what this thing looks like. Not too shabby, I guess. I'm liking the fur-lined hood. Can we look at the fur-lined hood in more detail? We can. Nice. I'm liking the look of that. So, no, I got what I wanted, so let's move on. Next up, we're going to look at my Elder Sigil rewards. Let's start with the weapons package. Let's acquire this. Boom, we've got Final Duty. We'll have a look at the rolls on that in just a moment. And for my armor package, we have Warden's Rally. So now let's have a look at those. Let's see what this is all about. It's a 335 pulse rifle, so I'm liking the light level. Excellent. We've got Reflex. We've got OEG Rifle Scope. We've got Counterbalance. We've got Speed Reload, Casket Mag, Skip Rounds, and we've got Feeding Frenzy. Let's have a little look at what this blue chroma makes it look like. It's pretty nice. Okay, so I'm happy with that. Uh, obviously, I'll have to test it out to see if it's any good, but thank you for the 335 light level item. Let's see what I get. Oh, nice. We've got my first 335 item for my hunter so that's for for my armor anyway so that's pretty decent i'm happy with that let's bung that on let's see what it looks like nice the old spikiness is back so that's my first 335 uh, piece of armor for my hunter which is nice we're going in the right direction let's move on next up we have this can you guess what i've been doing recently yes grinding the hell out of the crucible now i have the true meaning of war bounty that has the possibility of dropping a 335 light level item so that's pretty tasty but let's get rid of these normal crucible bounties first uh, and then we shall move on to Lord Shax's weekly crucible bounty. So let's burn through these and then hopefully we get something tasty at the end. This is the one that I've been waiting for. Bahoom! What did we get? We got spare change and we ranked up to future war cult rank 2. Yes, I'm a future war cult scrub on my hunter. So now let's have a little look and see what that weapon is all about, shall we? Let's have a little look at spare change. It dropped at 334. Nice, it's another pulse rifle and the description is keep it which is nice i like that is it any good though we've got red dot we've got focus lens we've got quick draw we've got surrounded mm, i'm not too keen on surrounded we've got perfect balance we've got reinforced barrel oiled frame and army of one so the perks for this aren't particularly great i don't think i will keep it so fuck you so yeah let's move on next up we're gonna have a little look at what i got in that future war cult package so let's open it kablam we got the spectre infinite vest should we pop that on we may as well see what it looks like it looks like this that's pretty damn normal i've also got a crucible package waiting for me so let's go open that righty then let's see what lord shaxi poo has for me boom let's see what we get we've got the longbow synthesis okay that's not too bad at all let's have a look at the perks now i'm no sniper here but i know that my friend andrew aka unknown player wants one of these bastards so let's see we've got long view we've got ambush We've got life support. Kills with this weapon while critically wounded have a chance to start regenerating health. Mmm, that's a bit shit on a sniper, I've got to say. Armor piercing rounds. We've got rifled barrel. We've got small ball. And we've got hidden hand. This target gains bet this weapon gains better target acquisition, which by all accounts is a fucking excellent perk 
for a sniper rifle. So nice, I'll be taking this for a whirl in the crucible. Thanks, Lord Shaxi Poo, you one-horned bastard. So then, we're gonna end the video by decoding some exotic engrams. Now, for some shitting reason, my live audio commentary cut out for the first half of this opening session, so you miss my reaction to getting a new shader. But the live commentary eventually kicks in, and I'll let you know when it does. Enjoy. That is pure McDonald's shader. That is literally the most McDonald's shader I have ever seen in my entire life. It's just, I'm gonna go and serve someone a fucking Big Mac. Check it out. Let me just ask anyone if they want a Big Mac. Hello, would you like a Big Mac? Anyone here? Fries, would you like fries with that, sir? Uh, anyone order a milkshake? You? Six nuggets? Fucking hell, look at it. Check it out. That's a horrible, horrible shader, and I absolutely fucking love it. Awesome, so there you go, that is the, what was it called again? The Lion Dancer. If you want to look like a McDonald's employee, and there's nothing wrong with that, get this shader. I think it's a Cryptarch specific shader, so I'm really happy with that. Um, okay, I got a little bit carried away there. Act on instinct. Where did this come from? Where did this come from? Right, we're going to now have a look at and see what the uh, exotics dropped out. I got a little bit carried away with my McDonald's shader. I apologise for that. We got 334 Zalo. We got 334 Last Word. We have uh, 334 Dragon's Breath. 335 Thunderlord. Nice. Please let this be 335. No, it's 334. What else did we get? Do you know what? It doesn't even matter. I got the McDonald's shader. I'm so happy with that. Check it out. Lion Dancer. That's what it's all about. Thanks for watching. Let's move on. And that, my friends, brings us to the end of the video. Now, if you'd like to see an awesome Cabal dropship glitch, click this image or follow the link that you'll find in the description box below. Thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Subscribe for daily Destiny content. And thanks for watching. Who you, yes, you beautiful bastard. And as always, hoodie hee hee. Until next time, Guardians.